What's up everybody, Chris Canote here coming at you with a brand new episode of The Canote Adventures. I have not made a vlog in so freaking long and I miss it dearly. So I thought it was about time again. So with that being said, welcome back to the channel and now off to our exciting journey as me and my beautiful girlfriend Lena explore the hidden gems of Eureka Springs, Arkansas. Today we're starting our day with a whimsical visit to none other than Quigley's Castle. Let's dive right in and uncover the enchantment that awaits. Quigley's Castle is a true masterpiece of whimsy and creativity. It's like stepping into a storybook world where the imagination knows no bounds. The vibrant gardens adorned with countless corky sculptures and colorful blooms make you feel like you've stumbled upon a fairy tale kingdom. Quigley's Castle, located in Eureka Springs, Arkansas, is a unique and enchanting attraction that offers visitors a glimpse into the creative and colorful world of Elise Quigley, a local artist with a passion for gardening and unique architectural design. Often referred to as the Ozark's strangest dwelling, Quigley's Castle is not your typical tourist destination. It is a testament to one woman's dedication to her passions and her desire to share them with the world. The story of Quigley's castle begins with Elise Quigley, a self-taught artist and gardener who in the 1940s transformed a modest Ozark farm into a whimsical wonderland. She was known for her distinctive style, combining vibrant colors and found materials to create unique sculptures and structures. Her love for gardening and her artistic talent converged to create a landscape that can only be described as a living work of art. As you approach the property, you'll be greeted by a riot of colors from the beautiful maintained gardens. Elise Quigley had a knack for growing an assortment of flowers and plants that thrive in the Ozark climate. Wandering through the gardens, you'll encounter her art installations, including colorful glass bottle trees, whimsical sculptures made from scrap metal, and other imaginative creations. The heart of Quigley's castle is the actual dwelling, which Elise Quigley designed and decorated herself. The house, constructed from native stone and decorated with her signature colorful tiles and mosaics, is a testament to her artistic vision. As you can see, visitors can take guided tours of the house where they'll see the quirky interior. Filled with Elise's handcrafted furniture, stained glass windows, and a personal art collection. Each room tells a story, showcasing her love for art, nature, and creativity. Quigley's Castle also provides visitors with a fascinating glimpse into the life and personality of Elise Quigley herself. Her dedication to art, gardening, and environmental conservation serves as an inspirational to all who visit. One of my favorite things about the house is how there were birds flying all around freely. Quigley's Castle is definitely a hidden gem in Eureka Springs, Arkansas. Now, after soaking in all that enchantment, we couldn't resist stopping by another iconic spot in Eureka Springs, the historic Crescent Hotel. Now folks, if you haven't been here before, you must stop by. You don't even have to stay the night here if you don't want to. Now, and just so you know, if you do stay the night, this place is known to be one of the most haunted hotels in the United States. They do ghost tours here and much more. It is beautiful, I highly recommend it. But we didn't just stop by, we also enjoyed a drink at their spectacular bar with a view that will leave you breathless. Just take a look at this view. Perched high atop a hill, the Crescent Hotel offers a panoramic vista of Eureka Springs that is simply jaw-dropping. Sipping on a refreshing cocktail with this scenery in the background is the definition of relaxation. After soaking in the incredible vistas, we decided to explore the spiritual side of Eureka Springs and discovered this hidden gem, the charming Catholic church tucked right behind the Crescent Hotel. This picturesque church excuses a peaceful and timeless charm. It's a quiet sanctuary nestled in the heart of this bustling town, providing a serene contrast to the lively streets of Eureka Springs. But our adventure didn't stop there. We headed back into town where the magic of Eureka Springs truly comes to life. The downtown area is a bustling hub of activity with its vibrant shops, incredible restaurants, and captivating architecture. We couldn't resist stopping by some of the unique boutiques and indulging in a delicious local cuisine at this awesome restaurant. The energy here is infectious. As the sun began to set, we wrapped up our adventure with a warm cup of coffee, taking in the charming atmosphere of downtown Eureka Springs. 
it's the perfect way to end a day full of exploration and wonder. And there you have it. Fellow adventurers, a day filled with whimsy, spirituality, and the vibrant heart of Eureka Springs, Arkansas. If you ever find yourself in this neck of the woods, be sure to check out Quigley's Castle. Take in the views at the Crescent Hotel. Explore the tranquil church grounds and immerse yourself in the bustling downtown scene. Until next time, keep exploring and embracing the beauty of our world. I'm Chris Canote with Canote Films, signing out. Thank you.